Vorhis, that was the name of that Nelf Guardian that took us to the horse races here. General Vorhis. So, pretty big place. Greetings, my lord, my lady. We're Lady Ingrid Vagelbud's guests. Your invitation, please. Hopefully that works out okay. Was in order. You'll find Lady Vagelbud in the estate's yard. Look for the parrot mask. Uh, one more thing. Uh, leave your swords here, please. Um. Um. I think I'm gonna have to agree with that, because I don't want to make a fuss right now. Fine. A pleasant evening to you both. I think I do get them back afterwards. It's beautiful here. I haven't been outside the city in ages. <laughs> So we will be here for a bit. With that scrawny harlot. Come now, don't cry. After all, he's not the only man in the world. But he's a baronet. Where will I find another baronet? So, there are a few tiny quests here as I remember. Uh, the first of one is I think Aside from looking at all these creepy people. Vivian? Is that any way to treat an old mate? Refuse to acknowledge him? There's been a mistake. I don't know you, sir. Don't be foolish, Vivian. I'd recognize that mane anywhere. Um... You might play the great dame now. But before that, Baron Edward something pulled you from the gutter, you were a common. Enough. The lady said she doesn't know you. Who's this? The new one? The new Over one. The last, it seems. A decrepit, moss covered prick. So, the less they can, the more they pay. Is that it? Ooh. Let's get out of here and Let's keep it go, friendly. Please. Wouldn't want to make a scene. Vivian! Hey! Oh, I liked you much better when you worked the carriages outside the passive floor, huh? Come back, you coward! What a jackass. I'm not done with you! You're not done with me? I think you are. Because you're not saying anything anymore, so... Let's check out this place a bit. You know the Ballad of the Wonder? Oh, Plague will another night with that whore. So, um... Just gonna pick up a few of those tiny conversations. Oh, and there he goes. Can I kick him? No, I can't. Ah, there we go. Yes, you are a Kraken. So let's get upstairs and through this gate. I think I can just enter it. Or not. Moritz, what are you doing here? Little Miss Miracle. Well, well. And I was led to believe this would be an elegant affair. I don't like yes, his voice. Yes, too. But can we put that aside for now? Do you have a way out of Novigrad? You can join us if you want. Hmm. Join you? And just who would I join? Your friends, among others. Once we've all gathered, I'll lead you. You will lead? Forgive me, Marigold, but that is like allowing myself to be led by a lame duck. Fair you kind of look like a duck. Uh, don't like that guy. Didn't like that guy. Why'd you insist on talking to him? He's an old friend. His name's Moritz Dyfenthal. Tell you the story later. I must say, she looks kind of foxy oh. in that mask. Let's look around. Yeah, that was lame, I know. Um... So there's a lot going on, but I think I can play a bit of Gwent with these guys and get a special card. So I'm going to do that. I'm gonna probably skip over it until I win. So see you guys after the match. Ah, another challenger. Please join us. Sir Devonan just vacated his place on the table. It's rather unlikely he'll be back. Ooh, did he lose? Some good men took him aside to prevent him from hurting himself. Oh, what? Oh, shall we play? Yes, First, we will. We will. Face Margrave Vladimir de Cray. 
first. Okay then, let's do it. Let's do it. Yes. Woo! That was close. Took a bit of uh, weird tactics, but so, he's down. When the cards come your way, you must spring on the opportunity. Milva. Your next opponent, Count Gomu Seelin. So as long as I his play, his the family estate in the Nimna Valley seems Gomu has followed in his footsteps. Yet, do not underestimate him. Desperate men can be dangerous. So as long as I play, I get more cards. I'm gonna do another match. Let's do it. So I do want to show this. Milva is uh How do I zoom here? Milva is one of the main characters from the books. So uh, with each arrow I lose, I think of my da. He'd be proud, I think. And she's a really cool character, I think. Uh, but I don't think she comes back in the games for some reason. But let me continue with my fight now, shall I? See you in a second. Okay. Don't think that calls me to lose, so yeah! Another win! So, one more round? When the cards come your way, you must spring on the opportunity! Another beast Sir card? Florin. They say he never loses thanks to his Zugulbone amulet. Naturally, I could tell you more on the subject, but... And then for the final match, I'd like to play. Let's do it. And double that, and then pass. Another win, and there we go, all three matches, matches won immediately. Dandelion. Yeah, I won't. Let's go. Triss, let's continue on with what we wanted to do. I think we need to meet with uh, Lady Vagelbud. There we go, Ingrid Vagelbud. Uh, excuse me a moment. Miss? Yes, it's me. The trout buyer? Hmm? Oh, yes, of course. Please excuse the precautions, but perhaps we could speak somewhere in private. Of course we can. Thank you for agreeing to help. My valet warned me you might come with a friend. I'd prefer as few as possible knew of Albert's flight. But if you trust this man, like no one else. Ooh. So any sign of the hunters? Any sign of the hunters recently? Since they attacked my servant at the market, none. All has been quiet. But I bribed a man of the temple guard. He claims there's more and more talk of Albert in the ranks. How did the guardsmen learn about your son's interests to begin with? <sighs> Unfortunately, I cannot be sure Albert himself was not the source. Merely boasting about an experiment. He's careless that way. Like his father. A kind man, but a dimwit. Devoured by an Arrakis. I don't know if you've heard. Yeah. Must have traveled far and wide. Hardly. He attempted to breed them. Perhaps I should be pleased Albert adopted alchemy as his hobby. A safe one, relatively speaking. Until recently, that is. Yeah, I can agree with that. If he got eaten. Ugh. Okay, let's go get him. Let's get Albert. Where is he? Entertaining the guests. He's always been an outsized presence at my receptions. I preferred not to arouse any suspicions. When can Probably we for the away? best. We shall have to wait until the guests have imbibed enough to notice only the goblet-laden trays. Don't fret. It won't be long. So in the meantime, we'll probably have to uh, kill some time. How will we recognize him? He's donned a panther mask. He knew you were due to come for him. Seemed rather excited, ironically. I'm afraid he's not fully comprehended the danger he faces. As I said, he's not terribly bright. Don't worry about that. He'll fit right in with a good number of the other mages. Ooh. Burn! Find him. I shall await word from you. So, um... Let's look for Albert. He's wearing a panther mask, but I'm gonna suppose there are a few panther masks. Oh, 
Um, I'm not really sure where I would find him there. Seems to be. What's this? So he's. Oh yeah, alchemy. That must be him. Yes. Albert Vagelbud. No. <laughs> I am a black panther. Yeah. I'm starting to see why he's not terribly bright. <laughs> Your mom sent us, Mr. Panther. Your mom sent us, Mr. Panther. Awesome. Oh, so you are. That got his attention. Yes, when can we leave the estate? Well, Mama said it would be best to wait Mama. until everyone's drunk. Besides, there'll be fireworks later. A jolly good distraction. Indeed. Once they've begun, I shall slip away, saunter into the garden. We'll meet in the hedge maze. Be waiting for you there. Very well. But first, you absolutely must try the Fiorano Rosé. Absolutely. Well, we shouldn't get drunk right, right now. I hope Albert hasn't forgotten the reason for this whole get-together. Wanna wait in the garden? I saw a nice spot there earlier. Ooh, that sounds, um... Romantic. Yeah, I swallowed there. So, let's see. Uh, we need to wait at the garden. <laughs> so this looks indeed like a nice spot. Yep, let's do. Relieved to get that mask off, if only for a little. Great view from here, and there's even wine. It's been so long since I've been to a feast, ball, or reception. Amazingly pleasant change from the sewers of Novigrad. Yeah, I can imagine. So, does this mean it's a good time to ask you about... Yes? About that mage we met earlier? Who are uh, you jealous, Geralt? What do you want to know? So as you can already hear by the music, this is one of the romance scenes where we have another decision. As I've said in the beginning, I want to pursue the relationship with Yennefer instead of the one with Triss. Uh, so I'm going to be a bit distant in this conversation. So be warned. How do you meet? <sighs> Geralt, all mages know each other. Some are well over a century old. That's plenty of time to make acquaintances. In that case, when did you meet him? At a feast, long ago. He walked up and just blatantly offered to teleport us somewhere quieter. Hmm. You turn him down? Is that what you think? He actually pursued me for a while afterwards. Yes, Carol, the girl has been with other men. So. Got the impression he doesn't exactly like you. I just think he'd love to have me as his charge, rather than his leader. See, but you're the one organizing the mage's escape from Novigrad. Sometimes I have no idea how I actually managed to bring them all together. Because you're uh, good at organizing stuff, I suppose. Um... They don't have anyone else. Well, I'm gonna be friendly, because we're still friends. You're a charismatic leader. Simple as that. You really think so? Absolutely. Next thing you know, they'll be calling you Iron Marigold. Could even wear an eye patch and it'd look right. <laughs> For a moment there, I thought you were being sincere. Uh, why wouldn't we be? Of course I'm being sincere. Look at me. Didn't blush a bit. Because <laughs> he can't really blush. Someone's coming. <laughs> Is it Albert? No, just some lost guest. Shh. must be looking for his beloved. Like in that elven tale about the frog and the lark. Inchu, inchu, beag broga. Inch by inch, little frog. <laughs> Shh, let's go. Oh. 
I'm he sure is a bit the other drunk. Kids don't get drunk as quickly as I did. Sooner we get out of here, the better. Oh no! I plan to have a good look at this famous maze of theirs first. I hear the statues there are completely, entirely. Entirely what? Let her speak. <laughs> yeah. That happens more than you <laughs> can take. Than you think. Chris, wait. Gerald, coming? Yeah, if you say it like that, I might be coming. <laughs> well, you're not really running away, are you? Um, Gerald, coming? Yeah, I'm right at your ass. There was another couple in the maze. Oh, look at this happy face. <laughs> Don't fall in now. Careful. I do like this scene. Just the way it's set up. So we could take advantage of this, but uh, not the time. We won't. Because she will want to. But she's also a bit drunk. Miss Merigold, at last. So sorry we are forced to meet under such incredibly inopportune circumstances. You can say that again. <laughs> but I'm sure we'll make up for it another time. I absolutely must show you my alchemical formulae. Oh, dude, fine? shut up. I don't believe so. Just in case, you two switch masks. We'll go first. Garrett will follow right after. Saddled horses await in the stables. Good. Meet you there. So now that we've switched masks, people might think that I'm... Arthur Vagelbud. So uh, let's get out of the labyrinth, but first, a quick save, because uh, we are going to get attacked. Albert! Why do you hide? Albert! There you are, my love! My love? Ooh, Here chest. you are. So, about this private show. Under any other circumstances, I'd give you the full Monty. Oh, I, I'm sorry, I... Oh, those guys don't look friendly. Albert Vagel. Albert, I said Arthur. Away, miss. So three guys, the fist fight. Not towards you, Count. Try anything, and you will get bruised. Hmm. Doubt it. So it's a uh, an unorthodox fist fight. I'm gonna try and make a bit more space because I can use my signs in this fight. So, uh, the easiest thing is just put them on fire. Because we don't need weapons to do that. I can't even eat during this. Lost your nerve? There they go. Yeah. Where do you come from? <clears throat> Let's beat this guy the normal way. There he goes. There was a chest around here. What's in here? Whew. Thanks. In certain circumstances, I will be able to use that gear, but I'm not going to right now. Because I just need to get out of this labyrinth really quickly. The fireworks are still going. Uh, 
and I can't even eat right now, so... Just in case, keep Gwen handy. And let's go find Triss and Albert in the stables. You would think they would get a bit more description about the guy they're supposed to uh, track down. Oh, she looks kind of mad. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Though you should probably send someone to uh, clean up the garden before any guests wander in there. I'm to send servants to the garden? Yes. I shall see to it. And you must hurry. Okay, we will. What's wrong, Triss? Everything set? Yes. Got your swords back from the guard. And Ingrid gave me the coin. It's, uh, it's more than I expected. Stunningly more, frankly. Well, good for you. I'm glad I could help. Glad I could help you collect it. You'll find a good use for it? It's finally possible, probable even, that we can get all the mages out of Novigrad. You know where to find me if you want to say goodbye. Oh, goodbye. Chris. What happened at the fountain? I'm sorry, I acted irresponsibly. It was the wine. <laughs> Too strong. No need to apologize. It was nothing. Yes. Nothing. Miss Fortress. We need to go. I know. Be careful. And there they go. I do find it interesting that all the women ride sideways on the horses in uh, The Witcher. Because I don't think it's necessary for them to do that. So. That's the uh, A Matter of Life and Death quest at the lovely Vegable Estate. So, and with that, we also get access to the Now or Never quest, which is to lead the, uh, the mages out of Novigrad, which we'll do really soon. I might do Sultan's Gwent quest first, since we already started that. But right now, I'm going to take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, those fireworks are really distracting. If you haven't already, don't forget to uh, subscribe. It's not, it's lightning. It's a thunderstorm. Okay, never mind. I'm getting really distracted. So if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because it really helps me uh, to support me in my future endeavors. So thank you guys again enormously for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video or stream. Goodbye.